Act of cunning needs to strike back, and she's brought her thistle pepperette to her contact Brian, who happens to be a Scotsman. That is rather lovely. I'll tell you the reasons why I bought it. Novelty silver is, is a good thing to buy. It's always desirable and collectible. This one is actually made by a rather important silversmith. If you look at it closely, you can see that it's got the initials JW in a, in a little circle for Joseph Wilmore. Joseph Wilmore was a significant silversmith and he was born in the 1770s and he flourished around the early 1800s. And he is a well-known and important silversmith of his time. We do, do see people collecting other items by him, namely snuff boxes and other small pieces of silver. I'm, I'm very impressed with you know, what you're seeing. And, uh, number one, the first thing is, I have never seen anything like that before. It's certainly a very, from my point of view, a unique piece. Is it something that you would be interested in? Ye yes, yes. Mm. 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 <laughs> That's okay. <a> cautious. <laughs> <laughs> I would like 150 pounds. 150, mm. that's see, uh, considerably beyond the mark. Is it? As far as I'm concerned, yes. I'd be looking at 100. I would like to say one, 140. You've dropped it 10, I'll up it 10 to 110. Oh, come on, Brian, 140 is good, isn't it? Well, I'll push it up another five, it's 115. Oh, Brian, <laughs> come on. Brian's making Catherine work for her money. Okay, well, I'll jump significantly. To 130. 135 is it done? Done. Done. That was easy. Mm. Been then. And our golden girl is really getting into the swing of things. She shows her Winnie the 